Hey guys, it's Sarah. So today, this is going to be kind of just a random in-between video. I wanted to do a review video for you guys because I just got the new Ariana Grande perfume spray in the mail and I wanted to review it for you guys just in case you wanted to buy it because I know that before I bought mine, I was a little bit curious as to how it worked and how it smelled and just basically what type of product it was. So I just wanted to do a quick review video for you guys on it. Yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay, so the product that I got was the Ari by Ariana Grande hairspray, and I know that this is not the newest line of Ariana's perfume, but this product was new to me, and I know that they don't sell these on the market anymore, really. This was actually an online exclusive at Kohl's. I actually had a $25 gift card, and so I got this for $5 because I only had to pay shipping, so I was like, why not? I wanted the hairspray because before I bought this product, I was under the impression that it probably smelled just like the perfume. So I was like, why don't I just try this because it costed $20 when this costs like $49. Maybe I can just cheat and use this as perfume instead of the hairspray. But under the impression that I was going to get the actual perfume in this bottle, I was wrong. Because when I opened this bottle, first of all, when I got it in the mail, the cap does not really fit well on this product. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the way that it was packaged when it was coming from Kohl's. The packaging is still really cute. It's just the top is lavender and then the little picture with her name on it is lavender. And then it just says hair mist and so yeah. So when I got this in the mail, I did already mention the cap was a little bit damaged but it is okay now, now that I am using it the day after. But it was also spilling, so I don't know why. Maybe it was just like kind of rolling around in the packaging. When I did open the box, the cap was a little bit off and it was kind of just in bubble wrap and it was kind of wet on the sides, meaning it probably spilled out a little bit, which was kind of disappointing. But yeah, it's still fine. And yeah, so now I'm going to move on to how this actually smells. Okay, so to be completely honest, and keep in mind, I am a huge Ariana fan. Everything that she does, I basically bow down to, and I am just like one of her biggest fans. So, I am not one to like say that I don't like something of hers. And this is probably the only time that I will say that I just don't really 100% like something. When I open this product, I can tell you honestly that it does smell like straight up alcohol. It smells like nail polish remover right when you open it. It does not, I can tell you literally, it does not even smell like Ari. I don't know why it smells like this. I can probably assume that this is why it got taken off the shelves in stores because I know they don't sell this in the store anymore. This has become like an exclusive, exclusive product along with the body lotion and the bath little bead things. So that's probably one of the reasons why they don't really sell it anymore. I'm not really sure. But it does smell like just like alcohol. I don't know. Maybe it's because it's supposed to be hair mist and not perfume. But like I honestly don't even know if it smells like Ari, like when I'm wearing it. I'm going to try it tonight when I go out and see if anyone comments on it. Because like when I usually wear this perfume out, people always comment on it. And I'm not even kidding. People are like, what perfume are you wearing? And I'm like, Ari by Ariana Grande. And I'm like, wow. So yeah, as you can see, I already have like half the bottle missing and I'm really depressed about it. Which is why I got this. But to my disappointment, it does not smell like Ari. So I don't know what makes this so different from the perfume. But I mean, it's not really a disappointment because like I guess I shouldn't have assumed that it was going to smell like it, but um, yeah, it doesn't really smell like Ari, which is kind of disappointing. But yeah, anyway, so you take off the cap and you just spray it on your hair, <laughs> just like hairspray. And again, I don't really know if it smells like Ari. It just gives off this like alcohol nail polish remover scent and I don't know why. Like, I just don't know what's in this that makes it so different. But, I mean, the first ingredient is alcohol, <laughs> so I guess that probably has something to do with it. I've heard from other people, other YouTubers that I've watched that the Sweet Like Candy Hair Mist does the same thing. So maybe it's just like the type of product. I mean, it's even getting in my mouth right now and it just tastes like bitter. I don't know. So, I don't know. I mean, I'm not disappointed with it, but just like, it's not really what I was expecting. I mean, I got it for $5, so like, I'm not complaining, but I just wanted to let you guys know that this does not smell like Ari, and it's kind of just a hairspray, like it's a legit hairspray, and just like, for anyone who wanted to use this as a perfume and not hair mist, don't do it, because it's not perfume. 
So that is really all I have for you guys today. I just wanted to show you guys a quick review on this product that I just got because I was really excited to get it. In addition to the hair mist that I just got yesterday, just to mention, I also have the rollerball, which I am looking forward to getting more of. I really like this. It's like easy roll-on perfume. You don't have to carry around the big bottle, and it's just like... It works the same as the perfume, it gives us the same amount of scent, and it's just like, I love it. And then I also, of course, have the actual Ari bottle. I just discovered the other day that you could take this little marshmallow puff ball off, which is really cool. But I'm going to leave it on because it's cute. And yeah, I only have half a bottle left. I'm probably going to ask for more for Christmas because this is my favorite scent. I don't know if I'm going to like Sweet Light Candy, and I just like this box, this packaging. The scent is just like my favorite. It's like marshmallow. I've heard that Sweet Like Candy is a little bit tangier and like I don't know if I'm going to like that. I don't know. I'm just going to stick with Ari because this is my favorite and I love it and I know that I love it. So I'm just going to stick with this one. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give this a thumbs up. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks guys. Bye.